from WXOW, this is Lacrosse's own News 19 Daybreak. Welcome back. For this week's Pet of the Week, we have Lori Olson in studio with a furry friends from uh, La Crescent Animal Rescue. Lori, it's always great to have you here. Uh, who do we have here with you today? You have Bitsy and I have Buzzy or Buzz. They are sisters and litter mates and we have collars on them because if you aren't familiar with their personalities, you otherwise probably cannot tell them apart. Yeah, black. Yeah, they're both very black furred. I don't even see any hint of white on no, nope, all black. So perfect for, I guess, all holidays. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Um, so uh, so what's, what's the history on Bitsy and Buzzy? So these were strays. They came in with another black kitty named Bean. Bean has gone home. These two girls are friends. They would love to go home together, but it's not an absolute. Uh, certainly if people had other pets at home, they'd prefer to have another companion there with them. Um, but they're both very sweet girls. Bitsy's kind of known. She will squeak at you and, and meow. Plus, you know, come up to see you. If people haven't been to our shelter, we do have some open rooms. And so they actually uh, will just kind of come up to people as they are entering for our open hours or cleaning and ask for some pets. Okay, so she's very vocal. Um, she well, squeaks, so she's she's vocal, but she's quiet, quietly vocal. <laughs> which is okay. different oh, than yeah, that, some other that cats. That is different. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. So um, they, their temperament seems to be very gentle, and they like to being pets. So. Um, oh yeah, and they like to be held. Yeah. So this is just an all new environment. There's lots of noises, lights, and things so, going on. So kids, other pets. Yep, they we, should do fine and, with and any either? of it. Okay. Yep. It's just a, a slow introductory process. We do for people who have other pets we offer something where we give them time to have a real slow introductory period because the slower the introduction the more likely it is to be successful so we would rather people take their time make sure that it's going to work out for their pets for themselves for our pets in their home uh, before we make anything official okay so if the someone wants to uh, adopt these two where would you suggest they go they can go to our website we do have a fillable PDF application or they can stop by one of our open hours on Wednesdays from 4 to 7 and Saturdays from 10 to 1 where they can stop by, meet these two, meet the other kitties that we have and see if there's a good match. Okay. Um, and there's others you have lots tons of other animals too so we do so. we have lots of them these girls are about five months old okay uh, so they're they're past uh, the silliness of the itty bitty kittens okay. um, but they still like to have fun but they're a lot they're calm, ready to go very calm <laughs> okay all right Lori well thank you so much for bringing these two with us today and we will uh, hopefully get them into a nice forever home soon we hope so. Thanks okay. for having us. All right, thank you. All right, if you want to find out more, obviously you can get check out our WXOW News 19 mobile app or online at WXOW.com to see more information about these two. And, uh, well, that, that's it. Okay. All right, so, all right, well, here's Kyle with a peek at our weather.